Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you installation of Node.js on Windows machine. Also, I will be showing you how to use it. So let's start the video. So guys, you can open any of your favorite browser and just search for Node.js download. So guys, here you can see it's showing the official website and here it is a link for downloading. So just click on this download link. So it will redirect you to this download page and here you can see we have uh, LTS and current so LTS is long term support so whenever you are installing node.js go for LTS and then here we have different operating system based on your operating system you can select I am having windows so 64 bit machine so I am just clicking on this button so it has started downloading and guys my download is done now to install it I am going to click on this MSI let me minimize my browser and here guys I am going to simply click on next button and now this is license and agreement page I need to check mark this and click on this next button and now guys here it is showing me the installation location where your node.js will be installed so if you wish to change you can click on change button otherwise click on this next button and now guys here it's showing me what all the thing will be installed in your node.js okay so so here I'm not changing anything I want to install everything I'm just clicking on next button and now guys here we have another checkbox so it is asking me to install additional tools and chocolatey so for running your node program you don't need this if you wish to install you can check mark and click on next button and now here I need to simply click on this install button so it will start installing so it is asking me permission so guys I am just clicking on yes and you can see my installation started it will not take more time so guys it is done I am simply clicking on this finish button so my node.js installation is done now we will be verifying it whether it is working or not so I am going to show you verification through three ways one is through command prompt another is through windows powershell and another is through node.js application so I have just started my cmd um, by typing cmd in search box and here I am typing node space hyphen v just to show the version of hyphen you can type node space hyphen hyphen version also it will also work so guys you can see it's showing me my version now I'm showing you version of npm also so for that again you can type uh, the command npm space hyphen hyphen version so now guys you can see it's showing me version of npm also Guys, after installing Node.js and NPM, now we will be installing Angular. So for that, we will be typing a command npm space install space minus g space at the rate angular slash cli. CLI is for command line interface. So this is the command for installing Angular on your system. And guys, you can see my installation has been started. It will take a while. So let's wait. So guys you can see my installation is done here it's showing me one message that uh, there is updation on this npm so if you want to install this updated you need to just type this command so let's update this npm so for that i will be typing a command npm space install space minus g space npm at the rate 10.2.1 so guys you can see the previous npm version i had as 9.8.1 now it's showing me that it has been upgraded so install it so i followed that step that's all guys so installation of angular js is also done now i'm going to type ng space v guys you can see here it is asking me something would you like to share the data uses so here i don't want to share so simply i'm just typing n so it will not share my data uses so here now you can see angular cli has been started guys and it's showing me the version of angular cli node version also it's showing me npm version and what operating system i'm using that also has been shown over here so guys this complete your installation of angular cli 
now guys i'm going to show you how to create project using angular so for that i'm creating one folder on desktop with the name cs corner this folder is empty guys i have not created anything inside this what i will do i will simply click on this folder and here i'm going to type cmd okay so it has started command prompt now for creating project i'm going to type a command that is ng space new and the project name here project name i'm giving as hello app so my command is ng space new space hello app and just hit enter guys it will ask you would you like to add angular routing so here i'm just going to type yes that is y letter and here it is asking me which style sheet format would you like to use so i want to use css so i just hit enter guys and you can see the creation of hello app project has been started so this project will be created inside my folder cs corner okay guys so let it get complete Home guys you can see the message packages installed successfully and here it's showing me some message related to git that is okay your project will work no problem with that so my project has been created successfully in my folder now uh, i will change the folder because my uh, project is inside cs corner in that one more folder has been created so for that i am writing cd hello app and guys after that just write ng space serve serve and boom guys you can see it has generated a link for me a browser link so http colon double slash localhost colon uh, uh, port number has been given over here so guys now uh, just open this link so you can copy and paste this link on a browser or you can click on control button and click with mouse okay so it will redirect you on to your browser page so this is done guys you can see here it's showing me my hello app project run guys i conclude my video i hope by following my video you are able to successfully do it so guys if really my video has helped you if by following my video you are able to successfully do this project then don't forget to hit on like button and guys if you have any query or if you have any problem you can comment in comment box i will surely reply to your queries and guys i'm there on different social media the link i have given in my description box you can follow me there uh, guys you can join my telegram channel if you want free pdf and notes related to computer science and it and guys the last thing if you have no not subscribe to my channel if my videos are really helping you do subscribe it and don't forget to hit bell icon to receive notifications from my channel thank you guys for watching my video till end i'll see you in my next video till that bye bye take care and keep learning guys